hi everybody so oh hi everybody um welcome back to my channel so today in this video i will be showing you how to pre-trip a thermal king reefer um so i still work with swift but i switched to the um the craft dedicated account um i'm doing reefer now and i'm gonna show you really quick uh how i pre-trip my reefer so so if you already work with swift and you were hauling driving and now you're gonna start uh on a refrigerated account um, you want to make sure that when you're looking for an empty, you want to make sure that it's fueled up at least three-fourths to full. If you're taking that empty to your pickup location, uh, if it's not full, uh, at least three-fourths, uh, three they will not take your empty. They're going to reject it. And when you're looking for an empty, you want to make sure that it's already filled up. You know, some people don't, some drivers don't uh, fill, uh, fill them up, so... But, you know, for the most part, they're always uh, good. But you always want to double check. If not, you would have to go fill them up. You also want to check the tires and stuff like that. Uh, the basic stuff that you would do on a regular drive-in. Okay, so to pre-trip this uh, reef. Uh, so first, the first thing you want to do, you want to turn it on uh, right here. I don't know if you could see this is the on and off button uh, this is so that if you want to put it in continuous or you want to put it in start stop mode so that you save fuel so to turn it on like I said you press here so to turn on it's right here okay for the system to turn on completely it would take like maybe i would say like um two to five minutes depending um some reefers are faster some are some take longer um but it's gonna get super noisy and i want to show you the buttons that you have to press so you always want to make sure before you go to the shipper that the reefer it's in good working condition that's why you always want to run the pre-trip so you want to program the reefer so it could check that the system is working properly the temperatures are right it's cooling properly and everything so um right now i'm just waiting for the reefer to turn on so i could show you all the um how to program the pre-trip so you see there's a set point gauge the sensor you're gonna press the one that says menu then you're gonna press the first one in this case it says pre-trip you're gonna select that one it's very self-explanatory now it's programming for pre-trip um, now you just gotta wait this process will take approximately like 10 minutes depending on the reefer you have you always want to make sure to wait the full time um if uh the uh reefer doesn't pass the pre-trip it will let you know that it failed uh you also have the light uh sensor it's gonna turn orange if it doesn't pass or um you're gonna see a k in this uh depending on the reefer you have so, um, let me see let me turn it on again maybe I don't want it to be too noisy. Uh, oh. Again. Let's see. Please wait, 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 wait. Okay, so to change the i mean to change the temperature you go here where it says set point and obviously if you want to higher you press the plus right here this one and then the negative if you want it cold uh colder and then you just press yes or no okay so well that's about it um and if you want to put it in start stop uh start stop mode you press this right here 
and new system mode is continuous or a new mode in cycle if the system has it it will apply it and if if if, if the reefer has the start stop mode and it's working then you'll see this face right here alien face kind of thing if it doesn't work then it won't show up and it, it will continue to be continuous so that's about it okay so that was a short video i know i did it too so, uh, super fast but the same as usual if you already work with swift and you have some experience hauling dry van pretty much is the same thing the only difference is the pre-trip so um it's very easy um uh the pre-trip is very uh you just gotta wait uh uh at least like 10 minutes i would say 10 15 minutes depending on the reefer you know some take less time some take longer but um get the idea that's how you pre-trip i didn't want to make this video too long so i hope you like the video if you want to know more about reefers and stuff like that please let me know ask me questions i'll be glad to um help you and explain anything um that you want to know i'm sorry that i've been taking too long to make more videos but um it gets very busy and um i've been uh running a lot so that's that thank you for watching my videos hope you enjoy it it's really fast